Hey everyone, this is Matt N3VAN, and in today's video, as you probably can tell, uh, we're going to be testing out what the Mars mod gives you for output power on the open frequencies. Uh, I have the MFJ uh, digital watt meter, as well as SWR meter, and I have it hooked up temporarily to the uh, UHF VHF side. I'm going to switch it over to the HF to show you guys the 6 meter, um, see how good the... Uh, the watts are on there. A lot of people on the uh, chats were in the comments were talking about um, half a watt or one watt, and we're gonna find out. And I charge this up. There we go, 7.9 volts. All right, so that is GMRS, and we're gonna transmit and see what she does. And that's 0.36 of a watt. Um, let's check to see what power level we're at. That's on low one. All right, so low one, let's check that. It's not even registering. Low two. Okay, registering 0.13 of a watt. Low three, 0.14. And let's go high. Let's see, once it resets. 0.36 for GMRS. Let's see, these are repeater ones. Let's see, am I still on high? Nope, that's low. Let's go to high. Still 0.36, so a little less than half a watt. Let me see, these are simplex frequencies. See what Simplex does. This should allow us to get a full, yeah, 3.18, 3.19 um, for the watts. Let's see what other frequencies we have here. There we go. And someone said to push them on. And I'll tell you what frequency it is. Okay. 223, that is the 1.25. Uh, meter band. Let's check to see what power outage there is. Power output there is. All right, we're gonna transmit on high power. Hey, full one watt. That's what uh, that's what the manufacturer says. They're not gonna give out the full um, supposed it up to five watts on there. I think that's when you plug it in directly into a battery pack, uh, not the one on the back, but you know a 12 volt. So one watt, not bad. Let's see, let me just key the repeater and see what we have here. All right, high, full power. W yep, 3.24 watts is the max I'm getting out on here. Uh, give me a few seconds, I'm gonna switch it over and we're gonna do the six meters and see what it does. I just had to switch this over and um, move that cable over to there. And by the way, I am actually powering this little meter using a nice little talent cell on there. <laughs> so I, I didn't want to drag my battery over here or hook up uh, something else on there. So that's what I'm using. So hang on one second, let's switch it over for six meters and we'll see uh, see how much output power there is. Okay everyone, I switched over to the, uh, the HF here over on the watt meter since we're gonna be doing 60 meters. And uh, let me, there we go. And that is the national calling frequency uh, for single sideband for six meters. Now, I don't have it hooked up to antenna. I have it hooked up to the dummy load, so uh, we don't have to worry about uh, uh, transmitting anything on there. So let's, uh, ooh, let me check to see what the output power is set at. Low, low, there we go. We're gonna switch it to high, and here we go. Wow, 2.7 watts. Wow, not bad. I was surprised. I thought uh, from what I read online and everything, it's going to be uh, uh, one watt max, but pleasantly surprised. Six watt, uh, not six watts, six meters gives you uh, 2.7 watts. Not bad at all. Yeah, 2.72. Perfect. That's not bad on six meters. Let's try a different, uh, let's go back to 200. Yeah, it's giving us a full... Uh, 2.72, almost 3 watts of output power. 
Interesting. So that's something new. I thought it was always going to be uh, one watt going out from what I read and uh, what people posted in the comments, but I guess that is incorrect. It gives you close to three watts of output power. I'll have to try that with an antenna, see if I can make some contacts on six meters. Uh, hope you found this uh, useful and uh, learned something. And if you like the content I'm creating, by all means, uh, please subscribe. And um, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. And any questions, by all means, put in the comments. I'm going to do one with an actual 6-meter antenna and uh, see if I can make some contacts on there. Anyway, this is Matt N3VAN signing off.